water signs, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. <laughs> What's popping? Did you miss me? <gasps> Cause I missed your motherfucking ass. Listen, this will be a weekly reading, your weekly astronomical tea. All right, for the water signs, Cancer, Pisces, and Scorpio from today, September the second. Okay, we're gonna say into the ninth uh, of September, twenty twenty one, honey. If you need a personal reading, I'm only taking emergency readings at this time. I have extended that until October the first. Okay, um, so I will go ahead and update the price list, or you can simply DM me if you're catching this over on Instagram, or you can email me if you're catching this over at YouTube um, at at mocha uh, m o c h a d e l o v e at gmail dot com. Okay, this message ain't finna resonate with every damn water sign. Y'all take what does, leave the rest. If that motherfucking shoe is too big, all right, don't try and put that motherfucker on. You're gonna fall, all right? Period. Leave that motherfucking shoe for somebody who can fit the shoe, all right? Take what resonates and leave the rest, all right? Without further ado, let's jump into a water signs. First and foremost, water signs 444. Protection, divine protection, divine love, baby. You are surrounded by your ancestors. There's no need to get angry. There's no need to fear. There's no need to doubt. There is no need to procrastinate, okay? I feel like for the, I feel like telling you guys that confidence, confidence is your key, okay? Y'all, I got so many. I've been spending the last 20 minutes just fucking singing and y'all energy. So I literally heard the messages within the music, okay? Or a lot of divine guidance or a lot, a lot of divine wisdom um, being channeled through the music, okay? So pay attention to the synchronicities as well as what's going on at that very moment because I feel like the divine is supporting you, okay? Through frequencies. A lot of a focus on frequency as well, elevating within your frequencies. Uh, I'm also hearing the activation of your light body, okay? A lot of you guys could really be getting... um more so in tune or trying to manifest the, uh, or I'm sorry, trying to master the art of manifestation, okay? Um, I did pick up on this energy as well as unfinished business, okay? Some of y'all got a motherfucking sociopath in the background that can't let something go. Somebody want, somebody's more, somebody's more focused on revenge versus focused on fucking justice. And I feel like that's the damn hold up when it comes to financial prosperity in your life. Whether this is you, because water times I'm here for some of y'all, this, this be you, Okay? For some of y'all, I don't know if this is you or this is someone who you're dealing with. A spirit is saying, yeah, this be you, okay? Some of y'all, there's a need for you to let go, okay? Surrender to the divine. Allow the divine to take um, to take uh, a course of action when it comes to justice on your behalf, okay? I'm also hearing slandering, okay? So either you're slandering somebody's name, water signs, or somebody's trying to slander your name. I'm also hearing obstruction, obstruction of justice, okay? So this could be going on within the workplace. I feel like there could also be some type of, like, workplace bullying, all right? Especially if there's an air sign, Gemini Libra Aquarius involved. I'm also hearing something regarding mimicking, okay? Mimicking or overshadowing, all right? Some of y'all gonna have to fucking set boundaries and speak up for your motherfucking self when it comes to people really, like... I feel like some of y'all got somebody trying to sun you, okay? And y'all not for the shits, all right? Um, I also picked up on this energy of... um. Okay, so I got a few songs for y'all, so I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna run it from there. Um, I did hear confidence is the key to success. Confidence is your key to success. Some of you guys could be dealing with the Leo. Some of you guys could also be involved with an Aries, or there is some type of like collaboration of sorts when it comes to executing something. Okay, um, I am hearing. Um, I heard the first song I'm hearing is Tank. I don't know what sign Tank is. All right, but it's um. Please don't go. Please don't go. All right? Some of y'all going to get your motherfucking way in a situation. You're going to have your way. However, you're going to have to show your ass in order to get it. And I feel like showing your ass doesn't mean acting a damn fool. I feel like gracefully removing your damn self. All right? I am hearing the divine is supporting your next step. Okay? The divine is supporting your next step. It's like faith without works is dead. So some of y'all got to actually get into action and get something moving. All right? And don't worry about, oh, am I going to have enough of this? Oh, am I going to have enough for that? Oh, I'm going to... You are being supported. Fo, fo, fo. Look it up. Okay? Do your due diligence, all right? I'm also hearing something regarding, uh, I heard pennies from heaven, so some of you guys could be finding a lot of coins at this time. I'm also hearing feathers. Pay attention to the synchronicity of what you're doing when you're finding feathers, because I feel like the divine is giving you the answer when it comes to what you're supposed to be doing, your life purpose. Some of you all are naturally humanitarians. You could have Aquarius in your chart, all right? Some of you guys also may have to step up or speak up in a situation. This could be involving family or a spouse. I am hearing scheming, okay? I'm hearing stay scheming. <laughs> trying to get at me okay i heard 
get the whole truth okay get the whole get the full story all right because some of y'all is dealing with an air sign gemini libra aquarius or oh, i'm also hearing another water sign that could be making the situation i heard omitted truth so somebody's not telling the full fucking story and i feel like for whoever that's for you can literally feel it within your core okay trust what you feel this is a this is the damn show a great week to trust what you feel before somebody get your ass caught up in a situation that has nothing to do with you, but you be the one for going, you be the one that takes the damn downfall for it. Okay, I am hearing strong air, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Okay, with that, I'm also hearing um, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo as well, and I'm also hearing Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. This I heard energy vampire. Some of y'all, y'all energy as it pertains to uh, Earth signs, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. This shit's just not meshing. Okay, there's some type of failure to understand, a failure to like come to some type of agreement or understanding. I feel like someone, someone's, all right, things didn't go, someone did not, hmm, someone only went about one route, or, or they only went, they only executed, okay, pause, how do I want to put this? Help me out, spirit. Okay, somebody only planned for something one way, someone try to use you against you okay and i feel like for some of you all you get in the front row seat to this person suffering due to their own damn negligence or their own damn disruptive ass behavior okay i feel like someone that you're attached to could actually be going or entering into their saturn cycle and i feel like it's affecting them financially okay i'm also picking up on um, I heard karmic debt, okay, or, or some type of like alignment when it comes to the uh, to the spiritual and the physical, and this has to do with like debt. I feel like for some of you all, some type of karmic debt has been paid, and I feel like you, a spirit is assisting you with aligning with the um, with aligning with the frequency of infinite abundance, okay. Some of you guys could also I heard unexpected pregnancy, okay. So some of y'all I picked I picked up on this energy of pregnancy, okay, but I feel like. Usually I would say, congratulations, Mocha love the kids. I'm going to still say that, congratulations, Mocha love the kids, okay? But some of y'all is not motherfucking happy about this pregnancy. I got this angry energy because I heard trapped, okay? So some of y'all, there could have been someone who, who had some type of intuitive nudge. Someone could have also been having a lot of, like, their awakening. I heard some of y'all is dealing with somebody who's going through an awakening or they're awakening to their gifts, okay? Of, I heard gifts of prophecy. Someone's also meant to evolve, but spirit is wanting you to go at something alone or... Uh, kind of like execute something. I heard I heard self-reliance, okay? So some of you guys are being separated. I heard temporary separation, all right? Temper, so some of y'all could be temporarily separated from someone to actually master something because this person's energy is not in alignment with your frequency, again, of infinite abundance. And I do feel that it has nothing to do with earthly ties. I feel like someone has been using you or uh, using your relationship to low-key like I feel this energy of like dumping someone dumping their problems onto you, but at the same time, this individual is emotionally unavailable unless they have something to talk about when it comes to how they feel. I feel like some of you guys are through with motherfucking one-sided relationships, partnerships, collaborations, okay, work situations. Some of y'all are taking a leap of faith. I'm also seeing somebody, I'm seeing a door slam, all right? Somebody may be cussing their damn boss out this week. Listen, don't cuss the bitch out. Just grab your things, okay? Go get you some Starbucks. Starbucks make everything better, period, okay? It makes every... Go ahead and check you out a damn mocha frappuccino, okay? All right? Get you a fucking caramel frappuccino and feel good, all right? Because I definitely feel like someone's trying to, like, rain on your parade. I'm also hearing someone's orchestrating a situation to make you lose your cool at work these people are trying not to pay your ass unemployment okay somebody want to make use you against you so hold your motherfucking cool don't quit your damn job let they ass fire you pull a no call no show on their ass but i feel like someone's trying to execute something to make you hang your damn self water signs okay i'm also picking up on the energy of creativity okay music all right again the message is within the music but for some of you all you are creators okay a great week to express uh, to express yourself through creativity whether it's painting okay for some of you all you actually create things with your hands some of you guys are beauticians i feel like there's a need for you to get structured as it pertains to how you're going to present something okay some of you guys could also be chefs as well i'm also hearing catered events okay or event or uh, event event coordination some of you guys could um some of you guys could actually sign us uh, be signing some type of contractual agreement to be an event coordinator okay a lot of focus on unseen blessings um unseen blessings and uh, unseen blessings and coordination okay i'm also hearing the divine is orchestrating some type of like okay the divine is orchestrating some type of like um i heard unseen blessing for those of you who are finding coins, I feel like that's being confirmed 
to actually move forward confidently because I do feel that it's like you don't need to worry. There's this energy of like, let it go. Bitch, ask Elsa how to let it go. All right. Um, but there's this energy of letting it go, okay, or not being afraid to walk away from something and, and not worrying about the consequence or feeling guilty behind making a damn decision for you. I've talked to y'all about this before, water signs, okay? Um, I'm also picking up on this energy of health, okay? Health scare. All right. Some of y'all, somebody, and I am picking up on whoever you are, you have earth in your chart very heavily. You could actually you could actually be a water sign moon, but like an earth, uh an earth sun or a fire sun. Some of you guys need to go to the doctor because I do feel something having to do. I heard ectopic, ep, 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 ectopic pregnancy. So for those of you who have your tubes tied, I feel like some of y'all may need to get some type of procedure done. Because some of y'all could actually be carrying uh, or be like, some of y'all could actually be pregnant, but you, the baby's within your tubes. I am hearing rupturing, okay? So some of y'all really need to like plan some type of like doctor's appointment, okay? I'm also picking up on something having to do with reconciliation or a warning about reconciliation in an STD, especially if you're dealing with the Sagittarius, okay? Or an Aquarius, or I'm also hearing Libra, okay? Someone's intentionally trying to like give you something or someone's trying to intentionally like, somebody know that they got that shit. And this person avoids going to the damn doctor, but they know that they got that shit. Whoever this is, they got that shit from someone who they have children with, all right? Especially if someone who they have children with, I'm hearing dance or somebody could be a stripper, okay? No shade on the strippers. I love y'all. Listen, I love y'all. Y'all my motherfucking babies, but whoever this is, this is a nasty motherfucker, okay? I'm also hearing something regarding, um... Okay, I, I heard something regarding protection. Even if you're using protection, if you're a, uh, if you're a male, water sign, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, I am hearing somebody is purposely trying to do something, like even around the protection. I'm also hearing that if you got in a recent, if you got in a new relationship, or if you've been dating someone within the last three to six months, I do feel like again, someone who they have a child with, especially if their fucking child's mother is another water sign, Pisces to be exact. Okay, um, this this person could also be a Capricorn. I'm also hearing. Leo, somebody's trying to orchestrate some type of downfall behind the scenes due to the, due to your person like supporting them financially. I feel like somebody cut somebody's somebody unplugged somebody's damn water. Somebody cut somebody's water short. And I feel like whoever this person is, now they're going through some type of like because whoever this baby mama is, it's a it's a it's a female. Whoever this baby mama is, she's very codependent. Somebody thought that something was going to be one way. Someone's also checking in on you or calling you out of the damn blue to see if they damn moon magic is working. Water time. Some of y'all friends, okay, been practicing moon magic on you. This could have even been someone who you actually introduced to spirituality, okay? I am hearing trust your dreams. Your dreams are very revealing this week, okay? Especially if you're dreaming about uh, another, uh, dreaming about the same person repetitively. I feel like your guys are trying to warn you of some type of un uh, upcoming event or someone's intentions behind the scenes, someone's subconscious intent. Okay, um, a lot of focus on the subconscious. Some of you guys could be tapping into higher realms. Okay, higher realms of knowledge. Some of y'all are tapping into your previous life and actually like some of y'all are having conversations with individuals this week and you don't know how the hell you know this information. You're accessing. Um, you're. Ac I'm hearing ancient knowledge. Okay, ancient wisdom. Some of you guys could have actually been magicians, sorcerers in your previous life. I'm also hearing something regarding moon magic. Some of you guys could be getting in tune or there's a need for you to get in tune with the moon to know how to work or how to manifest. I heard moon manifestations. I'm also hearing the art of meditation, okay, or mastering the art of meditation. It's something around your focus, being able to see clearly, see something clearly, focus on something clearly, and make a damn decision, not from an emotional space, but only what makes sense and only what you, only in the area where you see, okay, well, what makes sense, but also growth. It's pretty much, if I can't grow here, what the fuck are we doing? You know what I'm saying? I feel like either you feel this way or someone who you're connected with feels this way. I feel like somebody's tired of being like possessed, okay? Possessed, and okay, I'm also hearing possession, soul snatching, body snatchers, okay? I'm also hearing shape shifting. Some of you all have the ability or you're actually like realizing that you have the ability to shape shift, okay? I'm also hearing rabbits. Rabbits are going to be significant. Fertility, fertile energy. I'm also hearing planting seeds. Some of you guys could literally be gardening, okay? Some of y'all could also be turning to um, turning towards like a whole holistic way of living. I'm also hearing detox. Somebody looking for a damn detox to lose their baby weight, all right? I'm hearing Keisha K.O.R. Somebody just looked at some damn Keisha K.O.R. tea last night. Somebody couldn't sleep. They was looking up detox seeds. 
I'm also hearing Moldavite. Somebody could have recently purchased the Moldavite. I'm hearing things coming into alignment. There's a need for you to surrender the need to control or the need to know what happens next, okay? Because I do feel like something's coming completely out of left field, all right? So let's see. Let, let, me, let me shuffle these again. I shuffled like four times, y'all. We're going to do it again, okay? All right. Spirit, show me. What messages did you have for the water signs for the week of the 2nd of September? To the 9th of September? We say the eighth, ninth, some shit like that. Don't we? Let's say the ninth now. All right. Water signs. Water signs. What messages do you have for the water signs? Yes, have faith in your dreams. Wax and crescent moon, okay? For some of you all also, I am hearing something regarding looking up the moon phase in which you were born under because it has a lot of it has a lot of um Something about the moon phase that you were born under and manifestation knowing when to manifest. I'm also picking up on studying of the stars. Some of you guys could be astrologers. Some of you guys could be getting very heavily into numerology. Some of you all, this is your nine, this is your personal year nine. So I feel like a lot of things are ending for you and a lot of you guys are in this like, I'm stuck between your love and a hard place. Okay, so some of y'all could be stuck between love and a hard place. I feel like for some of you all, Love can become a distraction, so spirit is removing something out of your life that you couldn't do your damn self. And I feel like for some of you all, it is going to come by way of some type of third party interference. Okay, I heard some, I heard someone's okay, someone's not learning their lesson from Saturn. All right, when it comes to manipulation, doing things upright, and this is this person's karma. Butterflies could also be significant. Okay, I'm all they're also showing me a hawk, owls. Could be of significance. A lot of uh, a lot of focus around animal totems. Your ancestors connecting with you through animals. Some of you guys are needing to look that up. Okay. I'm also seeing something regarding lizards or chameleons. Okay. Adaptability. Yeah. A time to give rather than to take. So some of you guys, you may have to assist. Um, possibly a Virgo. Okay. But for some of you all, a Virgo may need some assistance. I'm also hearing health, uh, health related. So somebody could actually need you to like assist them when it comes to like recovering. Okay. Somebody could have actually had some surgery done. Uh, I'm hearing the lungs, lungs, cancer, lungs. Lung, okay. So somebody could actually have lung cancer. I feel like there's a father figure as well that is sick and they're not telling you. I feel like someone knows like someone's you, you got, okay. Whoever this is, your father is like omitting omitting uh information regarding their health they don't want you to worry even though this person is worried all right show the world the real you full moon and aquarius okay so some of you guys uh could actually be dealing with an aquarius again a lot of humanitarian vibes i do feel like um i heard community okay so some of you guys could actually be standing up or supporting some type of cause within your community this week all right some of you guys could also do non-charitable work or be tied to some type of non-profit organization or it could actually be um starting one or innovating some type of like non-profit organization within the community okay and you're being called to lead all right i'm also hearing um okay so i heard addictions addictions are standing in your way addiction some of y'all also could be looking at your damn bank account and reassessing like bitch i spend too much money okay i spend too much money on addiction some of you guys are cutting something out in order to better yourself in order to become a, a better version of yourself okay for some of y'all is someone step outside of your comfort zone north node all right also at the bottom of the deck you guys got surrender to the divine the full moon all right so this aquarius full moon could have really done a damn number when it comes to seeing things clearly or just like really bringing things to re bringing things to like your real okay bringing things into realization okay i feel like some of you guys are seeing a situation with new eyes i'm also hearing suffering and silence spirit is saying surrender to that shit speak your truth okay and don't worry about what happens next just be ready to just be ready to execute something by yourself i heard self-reliance i'm also hearing the seeds that you planted in the past is actually coming into fruition some of y'all is getting ready to get a beautiful opportunity when it comes to presenting your gifts okay i'm also hearing platform some of you guys could be starting a platform some of you guys could also actually be um i heard i heard interviews okay so some of y'all could actually be interviewers some y'all could work in the media production industry as well all right yeah the answers that you need are coming full moon and gemini i heard tell me how you really feel okay so some of y'all um i do feel that if there could be some type of upheaval as it pertains to a gemini i heard secrets family secrets okay family secrets so let's get it let's see what messages we got for cancer pisces scorpio i heard some of y'all okay 
<laughs> I'm hearing gator boots with the pimp thought Gucci suits. Ain't got no job, but I stay shy, okay? So some of y'all could be dealing with an irresponsible motherfucker, okay? I feel like for some of you all, whoever this individual is, um, I heard the lack there of a mother. So this person could have mother issues, whether it's a feminine or a masculine energy, okay? I'm hearing some of you guys, somebody has gotten too comfortable with you coddling them. So now that you're pulling your damn power back and you're actually noticing these things, I feel like somebody's kind of like, trying to stir up some motherfucking confusion but this is only to distract you from executing what it is that god is trying to um assist you with putting out okay let's see water signs water signs yeah some of you guys have another water sign cancer pisces scorpio someone wants to apologize okay however they fear being fucking rejected by you some of y'all could also be dealing with a water sign i mean i'm sorry fire sign aries leo sagittarius all right again some of y'all gonna get a front row seat to someone's spell work backfiring. I'm also picking up on this energy of evil eye. Um, some of y'all could be um, wearing some type of evil eye protection bracelets, okay? Some of you guys are also needing to clean your metaphysical tools, whether that's crystals, whether that's your cards. I'm hearing the releasing of energies, okay? Or the purging of, like, negative energy. I'm also picking up on if somebody's moving out of your house... Um, or are you kicking somebody the fuck out? Because I literally hear somebody saying, get the fuck out, okay? So somebody could be kicking someone out. When this person leaves, please stage your home in every room from back to, okay, from the back to the front. Work your way from the back of the home to the front of the home. Especially if you have children with this person, okay? I'm also hearing some type of energy is rubbing off on your children, all right? Some of y'all are also noticing that you have very prophetic children. Uh, I'm also picking up on whoever that was that was pregnant, all right? I am picking up on feminine energy. I, I see masculine energy as well, but I'm hearing prophets. Some of you guys are birthing a prophet, okay? Aligning with your spiritual beliefs, all right? Some of y'all gonna see how motherfucking fake friends and family is when you start fucking living for you and living through your own fucking beliefs. I feel like I see somebody, I heard Bible throwing. Somebody could be trying to throw the Bible at you. Someone could also be calling you the damn devil because you don't, because you choose to be spiritual and not religious, all right? I'm also picking up on, be very careful with having like conversations regarding politics and religion this week, especially if it comes to work because I feel like work and family, because I do feel like somebody could actually come to come to blows uh <laughs> come to blows all right some of you all your belief system could actually be causing an issue within your marriage okay i mean i am hearing divorce all right divorce i'm also hearing some of y'all have another water sign friend cancer pisces scorpio um this could also be an earth sign somebody's like throwing your ass under the bus when it comes to your spouse i feel like somebody's bad mouthing you some of y'all actually could be clear audience. Some of y'all, you could be hearing this, all right, in real time. I'm also picking up on the ringing of the ears, okay, being very intense. I'm also hearing water signs. There's a need for you to cover your feet and cover your head, all right? This week, cover your feet, cover your head. A lot of psychic attacks. I'm also hearing portals. Some of y'all could be researching portals, all right? Some of y'all could also be studying the stars, but I feel like constellations could be significant. I'm seeing something regarding Leo, okay? I'm also seeing something regarding Virgo. And I'm also hearing, again, alignment, okay? Children of the stars. Some of y'all are star seeds. Some of y'all children are star seeds. I'm also hearing therapy, okay? So some of you guys could be actually trying to get some type of certification to become a life coach, all right? Or a relationship, um, or like a relationship life coach, okay? Yeah. Some of y'all have an air sign, Gemini Libra Aquarius, stalking. I heard stalking, mimicking, mocking, slandering, Okay? Somebody's one way in your damn face. This could even be somebody who stands up like, oh, hey, sis, I got you, boot. that this bitch is not your sis, okay? Some of you all, your success triggers another person. And it's because you're, you, you have a vision to attain. You have a vision to build upon. This person is all over the goddamn place. I feel like someone lacks focus. Someone lacks accountability. Someone lacks determination and ambition. And they're threatened by your damn gifts and your independence and your ability to confidently execute something. Someone someone could have also been trying to do a number on your damn confidence, make you feel less than due to their own damn insecurities, okay? This could literally be a mother figure is what I'm hearing, all right? Some of you guys are prophets, okay? There's a lot of focus around prophetic dreams. I am seeing water could be of significance. Some of you guys could actually be um, dreaming about, like, some type of climatic event that's actually going to be occurring through the element of water and the earth. I'm also hearing earthquakes in, like, places where they don't naturally have earthquakes, okay? I heard the earth is war. Uh, the earth, the earth, the elements are warring on humanity. I'm also hearing something regarding conspiracy theories, okay? 
Some of you guys could be considered conspiracy theorists, but actually you're very prophetic and things are getting ready to come to pass. I'm also hearing something regarding um, immunization, okay? Immunization. I'm also picking up on something regarding the children, okay? So this could, I'm, okay. I'm picking up on some type of forced immunization. I'm also picking up on some type of like um, manipulation of your psyche. This could actually be like governmental, go, uh, gov governly, governmentally driven, all right? You will be approved. So for some of you all, you could be secretly look secretly um, looking for a place to move. Some of y'all getting ready to leave somebody in a, in, in a motherfucking space that y'all share. I'm also hearing watch your belongings, watch your belongings, and put up any type of valuable valuable. What the fuck is my word? Where Mercury at, bitch? Mercury, please, sis, let me be great, okay? Um, <laughs> I'm picking up on this energy of like, um. Watch your shit, okay? Especially if you have to have the maintenance people come in and do something. I'm seeing something regarding a necklace, okay? A necklace. I'm also seeing a bracelet as well. Somebody's shit may come up missing, and it's the maintenance, all right? Sacral chakra, okay? Fate thief. Didn't I tell you? Somebody could be trying to do a motherfucking number on your damn confidence, all right? Your ability to actually get something done. If you've been feeling very sluggish or very, like, tired, all right? For some of you all, this could actually be to some type of unexpected pregnancy. But for some of you all, you got a petty-ass magician bitch playing with you, okay? This person wants to manipulate their way back in your life. And somebody doesn't know how to fix something. It's gone. So much So much time has gone by, okay? You guys got evil eye, all right? So for those of you who are music, ugh, mug, magicians, magicians, okay, or musicians, all right? Um, I am picking up on, make sure that you're protecting yourself, protecting your content, okay, protecting what it is that you create, because I do feel like somebody's like underhandedly trying to fucking snake your ass. Some of y'all could literally be dreaming of snakes. I'm also hearing your interpretation, seeing things from a multidimensional space, seeing things from just one space. I also heard, don't discern anything from, or, or don't try to like, don't make some type of major decision, or don't try to discern something. Okay, I'm hearing discerning, but using your discernment not from an emotional space. Don't make, don't let a temporary emotional, uh, don't don't let a, a temporarily emotional moment have you to like make a crazy ass long term decision or something that's going to affect the long term. Okay, especially if this is having to do with a marriage. All right, I'm also hearing couples therapy. Okay, some of y'all could actually be um, couples therapists. Okay, I'm also picking up on. Um, I heard addressing childhood wounds. Some of y'all, this could have to do with like sexual abuse as well. Some of you guys, you're remembering something. Something's coming back into like, something's coming back up in order to be like dealt with, handled or resolved or bring some type of resolution and healing, okay, to the surface or to the forefront or the opportunity to so that you can make an informed decision on how you're going to move, all right? Allow the divine to bring the situation back around full circle and hold your temper, okay? Some of y'all got an air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Somebody's drawing you in. I heard someone could be conjuring you or calling you in. Especially if you wasn't worried about a motherfucking all of a sudden you find yourself going to their damn pages and looking their ass up. It's because this person is like conjuring you. They're calling you in. For some of you all also, you could have, okay, I heard polygamy. So some of y'all could have actually been in a polygamy situation. You make the other you make the other spouse insecure about their body or their ability to please their partner, which is why they're holding on to some type of like grudge or anger towards you, okay? Yeah, solar plexus chakra. Some of you guys are needing to align your sacral and your solar plexus chakra. I heard it's I heard you are what you eat, okay? You are what you eat. Some of y'all could also be hiding a pregnancy, especially if you're in the public uh, public eye. You guys also got crown chakra. So there's a need for you guys to get aligned within your chakra system. Also, a lot of activity around the uh, the crown chakra. I'm hearing downloads, uploads, okay? I'm also hearing esoteric information, esoteric knowledge, esoteric wisdom, all right? Yeah, save your damn money, okay? Some of y'all are needing to save your money for something. Okay, I heard unexpected ex expense. This could actually be some type of car expense. I'm seeing something regarding tires, okay? For some of you all, I'm also hearing something regarding, um, okay, this could also be like batteries. Um, I'm also hearing emissions, all right? Some of y'all check engine light may come on, and it does have to do with the emissions. Some of y'all also need to flush out your damn transmission. I'm also hearing catalytic, convert uh, catalytic converter. Someone may need a catalytic converter soon, okay? Whoever this is, or this could be you, uh, first name starts with U, V, W, D, Y, O, S, T, 
N Z I Q E G. Okay, this person could be a part of this damn gang stalking with you, or some of y'all could actually be getting gang stalked. But no worries, there's gonna be some type of an ancestral interference. Someone's waiting on you to react to know if their fucking magic is working. And water signs, y'all are gracefully being smooth. You know the shit is going on, but spirit is saying, say less, watch me work. Okay, yeah, bitch, observe more. Say less, watch me work. For some of you all. You got a two-faced friend that's going to be put on goddamn front street. How this is going to work is someone's, someone's like snaking their damn way to like confront you. I feel like they, 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 they're, they're cowardly in spirit. So they're not going to do it themselves. They're orchestrating or trying to alchemize other people's fucking energy. Okay. To affect you. But spirit is saying, worry not. How that's going to work is the same motherfuckers who was talking shit about your ass. They're getting ready to have a damn confrontation. And everything that was said about you is going to be laid on the damn forefront. So again, you can make an informed damn decision. Okay. Forgiveness. They're saying forgive the situation. Forgive yourself and forgive their ass. Not for them, but for you. Don't hold that. Because can we grow on that? Can we? Can, what can grow from resentment? What can grow from anger? What can grow from revenge? Besides some type of karmic ass consequence, some of y'all have cleared your karmic debt. Don't let a fucking bit of motherfucker, you know what I'm saying, have you fucking going 10 steps backwards. You don't work too damn hard, all right? Forgery, fraudulent activities, okay? Be very careful to like read, read over documents, paperwork. I'm also hearing some type of forgery or fraudulent activity going on within the family that's going to be talked about or coming to the forefront. I do feel I heard they all lean on it. I, okay. A situation where a bunch of mother, a bunch of greedy motherfuckers who are ganged up against you to steal from you, okay? That's going to be coming to the forefront because I feel like one greedy motherfucker used everybody else and then fucked over everybody. And I feel like somebody got some shit to say, okay? This could be involving a fire sign. At the bottom of the deck, you guys got, they ain't your friend. They just need the 411 in your life. Someone wants to know what it is that you fucking manifesting so they can fucking try to block it, all right? Straight like that. You guys also got harvest, okay? So some type of unseen blessing, unexpected money, okay? For some of you all, I'm also hearing follow your urges. If you are not the type, I, I would never, I would never fucking, I would never fucking like um, uh, promote gambling, okay? But I do feel like some type of unseen blessing or something that was unexpected. I'm also hearing unexpected payout. I'm also hearing something having to do with um, some contract or something that was like set in stone. This could even be work related. Some of y'all could also be finding out that you were getting paid the wrong damn dollar amount. I feel like someone's going to fix something for you. Okay. All right. Someone's going to fix something for you or something's going to be unexpectedly corrected for you. I'm also hearing something regarding disability. I'm also hearing unemployment benefits. Something's going to be um, I heard retroactive, so something's being paid back. Some of y'all is getting some type of unexpected child support payment, too. All right, so give me some advice. No, hold on. Who water signs fucking dealing with, honey? Who water signs dealing with? Give me six signs. I heard six. Give me six. All right, Leo. Who are water signs dealing with? I'm also hearing there's some type of caution that needs to be had with dealing with a Leo. I feel like somebody got one foot in, one foot out. Someone's coming in to test the waters only to gaslight your ass again. Something's coming back around for you to reject somebody who rejected you. But this person was the catalyst to your awakening. Now that you've awakened, now that you're actually like walking in your power, this person is going through that same that same thing that you went through emotionally. But I feel like this person couldn't walk a day in your motherfucking shoes if you paid them, okay? Gemini rising, all right? This could be you or the person that you're dealing with. I'm also hearing a sneaky link going wrong. Somebody going to get caught cheating. I'm also hearing someone could actually be arguing with a friend of theirs in front of their spouse or get into it with a friend. And this person kind of puts you on blast for cheating. Some, somebody's, somebody who was jealous of your relationship in the first place, okay? You guys got Virgo Moon. All right. Water signs dealing with. Who is this? Virgo, I heard envious, envious, okay, well, how would that feel, I'm going to take it, Pisces moon, Pisces, mutable north node, Sagittarius, Pisces, Virgo, Gemini, this person can have a mutable north node, okay, you guys got Scorpio moon, and at the bottom of the deck, you guys got Taurus, all right, I feel like someone wants to benefit, someone wants to, like, benefit off the off of the luxuries, off of the luxury of your manifestations, of your thing, of your harvest. But this person, it's like, bitch, you wasn't with me shooting in the gym. Somebody wasn't with you shooting in the motherfucking gym water signs. Some of y'all, listen. 
I'm going where the money reside, motherfucker, but you won't be there. You hear me? The divine is making sure of it. I heard by choice, about force. I got that in the uh, earth sign reading, so some of y'all could literally be dealing with an earth sign, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. I feel like the, the divine is using you to give somebody a wake-up call. You are someone's karma, all right? You're being aligned with your life purpose, which has to do with creating an expression. This is a great week to put your music out. This is a great week to do your damn poetry. This is a great week to paint. This is a great week to create, my baby, because it's blessed. It's blessed. You're being aligned with your purpose. It's blessed. For some of you all, you could actually be um, motivational speakers as well. I heard uplifting. Some of you guys are going to be motivated this week. Something's motivating you in order to get started with something, okay? Give me uh, some advice cards for my water signs. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, okay? Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Did I tell you resolution and healing coming in, baby? Allow the, allow the divine to work. When Mercury goes retrograde into Libra, I definitely feel like a lot of truths being exposed. This last full moon that we had in Aquarius, again, tell me how the fuck you really feel. Whatever is falling away, baby, it's for your highest good because you don't know people's hearts. Just because they smile in your face don't mean that they don't got the fucking intention to set your ass up and steal from you later. Someone knows that somebody's getting ready to come into some type of inheritance and they want to be, they want to be close to you. They want to have that access to be able to take from you, baby. So if you're cutting somebody out, it's a divine driving this, all right? Trust your fucking intuition, okay? Forgive yourself and forgive others. Not for them, but for you. Forgiveness has come out twice. For some of you all, this could actually be forgiving your mother figure for allowing you to be sexually abused due to their own damn addictions, okay? Someone that you're dealing with could actually have addictions that actually trigger you from your childhood when it comes to uh, to um, to uh, to your mother figure. I'm also hearing addiction counselors. Some of you guys could be uh, volunteering at a homeless shelter or like talking to people or being some type of motivational speaker or assisting people with like letting go of addictions, okay? Yeah, but this week is going to be a week of detaching and moving on. Let go and let God, baby. Choosing faith over fear and allowing God to show you who God is by you just following what makes you happy, my baby. By you doing so, you're aligning with your north node. I heard stepping into your true north. Give me one more. Yeah, didn't this shit come out again? Create and express. They're saying use it. Transmutation, the art of transmutation, transmuting that pain into power. Because it's definitely going to get a positive response. Don't worry about it. The people who you fucking know don't like it. It's not the people who you know that's going to help you to grow. It's the people who you least expect. Some of y'all going to have a damn revelation or some type of epiphany around that whole trust issue shit. I don't trust nobody, baby. I don't trust this. I don't trust that. Spirit is giving you a different perception. They're shifting your perception on how you look at things. Okay? At the bottom of the deck again, follow what makes you happy. Worry not, baby. Don't worry about what's to come, what you're going to lose, what you don't have, what you won't have. Allow God to be in control. All right? So, you guys, please let me know. All right? In the comments, what the fuck is going on, Water Signs? Because some of y'all finna have to let some shit go. If he ain't going to love you the way he should, then let it go. If he ain't going to treat you the way he should, then let it go. When the song come on, they're going mm, to they be like, damn, that's hot. Huh? You hear me? You hit, When your song come on and it drop, we're going to be like, damn, that's hot. Do you hear what I'm saying? The message is in the music. Keep going, my babies. All right? I love y'all a long time. I pray that this message finds you in love, okay, and light, a lot of divine wisdom, and I'm sending y'all big money bag energy. You hear me? Until next time, bye, booze. I love y'all.